This is K4ATZ. I'm going to show you how to set an offset. Um, first, the thing you need to do is you go, if you want to set the amount of offset, is you go into the memory mode. And you can see that it automatically changes the display. And I think most of this is pretty good about being in alphabetical order. So here we go, it says repeat offset, and then you would change the offset by your main tuning. So for FM um, 2 meter, you generally do, you know, 600, and um, whatever the 440 is, is I, I can't remember off the bat, because I don't do 440 much, but... On six meters, the only reason I know this so good is I just did it. I have it at a thousand, or excuse me, one megahertz or a thousand kilohertz. And then simply push to get out of the display. So you're set up now for the repeater offset. To get into the plus or minus the ALT button, which is doubles of the mode, you have to hold it down. And now you see I've got plus. You have to do this kind of quickly. Simplex or minus. So that will take that one megahertz, a thousand kilohertz, and it'll make you take it out so you're on simplex. Minus. And don't ask me why it shows up zero. I haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> but I know that if you do this and put it into that mode, it will work. Okay, so let's just do plus and show you. All right, 53.84, just a random frequency. And then see, it goes to 54. If I do simplex, I'm right on the frequency. And negative, you go down. So that's a very quick and short way to explain and to see instead of going through the book. Your repeater offset selection of how much, how, um, what frequency or how much your offset is, and then how to get into that and turn it on on the radio. 73 is K4ATZ.